auto. That is a great idea. Unfortunately, I'm not. Hello, guys, and welcome back to my channel. Today, we are going to be doing another reading my DMs video. You guys really enjoyed the last one, so here we are again. <laughs> what does DM stand for? <gasps> Tommy, mom. No, no, no. What does it actually stand for? We need to search this up. What does DM stand for? Oh, direct message. Yeah. Mm. I was, I was close. That was close. Actually, really close. Please make sure you hit the sub button and let's jump into the video. Pray for me. P please, please. Ser no, ser seriously. This, I'm, I'm being serious. Um, please. Here we go. We're entering the dark unknown. <laughs> the first message we have is from Corey and he says, I want to lick your toes until they get wrinkles like after swimming for a long time. <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to laugh or cry. <laughs> How long do you think my toes would need to be in someone's mouth for to go wrinkly? Like is like five minutes? <laughs> five, ten, ten. I've already had enough. Um, okay, we have Blake and he messaged me saying, um, I would my family just for you to spit in my mouth. Open what? I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm not spitting in anyone's mouth. Okay. Keep those mouths closed. I don't know if this is someone's name, but their name is like Serbian. I don't know if that's a name or if that's like that, 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 that Serbian. Is, is that... Serb Serbian? Serbia? Country? Is that a... Yeah. You know what? Let's just go with it. He said, hi, hon. Okay, okay. Good start. Do you selling your dirty panties? I would like to buy one from you. Why not a clean pet, huh? What's wrong with a clean one? You, you, you don't want some freshly nice smelling... Not saying that my dirty ones aren't... Not, you, Okay, wait, whoa, whoa, listen, it smells like roses, 24, everything smells like roses, that's not what I was trying to say, I was trying to say everything, you know what, I, I, I smell good no matter what, that's what I'm trying to say, but like, why wouldn't you want some freshly cleaned ones, not some ones that have been, I actually get a lot of um, DMs like this. This is actually kind of a common DM. And no, before you ask, I have never and I will never sell those. Yuck. What the f***? Oh, oh, this is so good. Okay, this is from Dev. He said, I am one of your biggest fans of your YouTube channel. Sometimes whenever I feel bored or stressed, I will watch your YouTube videos or shorts. You are like a stress buster for, to me. Wait, hold on. Hold on, what you mean by that? Wait, 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 <laughs> wait. Anyways, then he proceeds to reply to every single story of mine with multiple throwing up emojis. Mans was like, you didn't reply to me. You, f you. <laughs> now you are disgusting. Now you are, bleh. Hello, Minka. I just want to say you're my favorite streamer and YouTube. You really laugh so much. You're very open-minded and I just want to say keep doing what you're doing and I hope you reach 1 million subs on YouTube soon. <gasps> I hope I reach 1 million subs on YouTube soon as well. I need to turn my aircon on. I'm getting flustered. No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. We had a wholesome message from Chris originally. He said, hey, Mika, what are the chances of you seeing this message? Okay, but he spelt, he said seen instead of seeing, you know, it's cool. I get it. My IQ is very high. I know that a lot of people can't relate. It's, you know, it's hard being extremely intelligent out here like Einstein. Wait, was Einstein the smart one? Anyways, then he follows it up by, I wish I could be your toilet for you to sit on my face. I don't need a toilet when I've got Chris. I don't need a toilet when I've got Chris. I'm gonna be like, Chris, hey, yo, let's tour the world. I just need to take a shit. Chris is just there on the floor ready. Ah. Uh, I'm just kidding. I'm just, I, I would never, no, no. Ew, ew, ew. What, what, how do you even type that message? What goes through your mind to sit there and actually type that out? Like, imagine if I said that to you. Okay, you know what? I'm not going to say imagine if I said that to you because you guys will take me up on the offer. You'll be like, hell yeah, Mika. I would love to shit on your face. <laughs> okay, so we have Evan who has sent me a message for like the past three months again, um, reminding me that um, I'm his TikTok crush. Should I reply? Let me know down below if I should reply. Let me know. 
Chris sent me a really nice message. He said, um, I'd like to hang out the back of you. Question mark, exclamation mark. Um, eggplant emoji, wet emoji, and drool emoji. Yep. Yep. That's wow. You know what? The message before that, he said, why are you so perfect? So you know what? They, they kind of cancel each other out. Maybe. Maybe. Okay. We have Adam. He said, uh, step on me, mommy. And then crying face, crying face. And then like a face and then he said hey mika are you mississippi because you are the only miss whose piss i sip pee. you know i've heard the tennessee one like hey are you from tennessee because you're the only 10 i see who the f it came up with this i have never heard this before you know what i'm gonna give that i'm actually gonna rate that like an 8 out of 10 that was funny as that was funny that was a good job round of applause round of applause creative funny um it rhymes loki could be a rapper like i vibe it i'm kind of weird though like i'm minus one point because a little bit weird i posted a story of one of my rooms um downstairs it has a pool table in it and it has a pole like a dancing pole in it because i do pole dancing for fun literally it's good exercise it's good upper body strength and someone replied to my my instagram story and said is it your home or some kind of strip club i guess that's what my house be looking like nowadays huh <laughs> i actually love reading my dms like this is so fun <laughs> there's so much weird stuff in here but it's funny it's funny this guy had the audacity to reply to my instagram story where i said we hit six thousand six hundred and six my IQ is very high. I know that a lot of people can't relate. 666,000 <laughs> subscribers on YouTube. He said, yeah, without any talent, LMAO. I will have you know, I'm actually very talented in many, in many different areas of life. I, I can, um, I, I can imper, impersonate, imp impersonate dobby and uh, no not dobby <laughs> donnie from the wild thornberries <laughs> oh so um i'm great at cooking i i i cook up a i cook up i'm basically gordon ramsay i cook up a storm in the kitchen i can do cool tongue tricks yeah bet you can't do that huh yeah that's what i thought you know what well, i have many talents many talents i'm a girl of many many talents okay you better watch your fucking mouth okay um nathan said if 3k was sent to you what would you use it for food oh i'm i'm such a foodie like give me food and i'm happy feed me food and i'm happy i'm like an animal when it comes to food let me eat your coochie with nutella bbg i i assume bbg stands for baby girl i don't know is this like this is just like teenager slang i'm getting old now i'm i'm 23 okay look i i know i look like i'm like 18 i'm 23 i don't i don't know this slang anymore i assume it means baby girl first of all i love nutella but secondly no thirdly i'm sure that would lead to some sort of infection you know not not safe not not safe for for, for consumption okay put it on some bread this is interesting demetrius who um looks like a bike here um like 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 you know he's got his arms crossed like this and he's wearing sunglasses and he has like a white beard um bald he said i am here looking for a sugar baby i don't know if you might like my idea i got attracted to your pictures i noticed you're a cool person and i decided to text you first of all demetrius you direct messaged me okay you didn't text me get with get with the program okay secondly hit me up with the price i'm just kidding I'm, I'm i'm not looking to be anyone's anyone's sugar baby you know what i'll be someone's sugar mama no i'm, I'm not gonna do that either uh, yeah I mean, maybe maybe you know what maybe maybe i will maybe i won't you guys will never know <laughs> Jaden has sent me 169 messages saying day one to mommy replies day two to mommy replies day three to mommy replies i'm not mommy by the way i i don't know who the f mommy is it's not me <laughs> um and i actually replied to him i actually replied to him let me see what i said i said flushed face dedication and he said you replied <sighs> all right um we have some like 
We have a couple pickup lines. Can I be the stuffed to your crust? And do you want to be the apple to my crumble? Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Actually, I'm not a big crust person. I don't eat the crust of anything. I don't eat the crust of pizzas. Never. Ever. It doesn't it doesn't taste good. And it's it's crunch. I don't really like crunchy things. I like soft things. Like I like my pizza to be soft and soggy. I like my chips to be soft and soggy. I like soft and soggy things. Well, I'm not going to live that one down. <laughs> okay, so we have another bald man with um, a gray beard um, who looks like he's maybe between the ages of 50 and 60. I guess I just attract the daddies, <laughs> the granddaddies, the grandpuppies. <laughs> he said, what do women's breasts and toy train sets have in common? They're both intended for children, but it's the father who always plays with them. <laughs> I don't know how many how many titties you've played with in your lifetime, but I don't need to know that info. All right? I don't I don't need to know. I don't need to know it. I don't need to know it. Okay, so this one is from John, and it looks like it might be sad. He said, "Michaela, my cousin is close to his last breath." Whoa, that's deep. And he said that the last thing he wants to see is your new hoods. Tell him to hit me up. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Ah! No, 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 no. I, that, that's, uh, I, I don't think that's real. If it's real, I'm so sorry. Um, uh, don't tell him to hit me up. <laughs> I can't fulfill those dreams, unfortunately. But you know what? I hope he gets better. <laughs> Okay, we have we have Callan. Callan um replying to my story saying ugly. Gee, geez, thanks. Thanks for the for the confidence booth boost booth booth booth. It's hard being extremely intelligent out here like Einstein. Brain! Work! These are my favorite DMs. They always make me laugh. I don't know. I don't know why. Like taking the time out of your day to insult me. Chef Kiss. Hi. I know you won't read my message, neither reply. But I just want to say I seriously love you. I wish to date you just one time. Your cute kiddish nature is making me crazy about you day by day. I love your eyes. Most importantly, I love your hair. Can you go on a date with me, please? I'm sure I won't let you down. The enthusiasm! You know what? I appreciate the fact that he didn't like say anything weird to me. Like there was no like kitchen sniffing, feet licking, panty eating, panty li You get the point. You know what? It was, it was kind of wholesome, kind of weird, kind of weird, but you know, a little came on a little bit too strong. Maybe just like maybe 50%, 50% less. That that's good. That's good. And then and then and then yeah, nice. This one's kind of funny because he has a picture of him and his wife as his profile picture and like, you know, he looks about the age of like 55, 60 and he says, I bet you taste amazing. <sighs> Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye world. Goodbye. All right, guys, that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, you better have enjoyed that. You know what? The, the amount of If you did enjoy, please make sure to hit the sub button, hit the like button and drop a comment down below. I would really appreciate it. And I will see you guys as always in the next video. 